Hey Maximizers and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Crystal. There's Kinsley. And today we are going to do our CVS haul. So my new shopping days are Tuesdays. I told you guys that a couple weeks ago. I did not do a top deals video this week because there really wasn't that many CVS deals. But there are a couple of things that I want to grab. So I did create a little um top deals breakdown it's going to be linked here in the description box so please if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up share it with a friend um so that they can get some deals too so what crystal is going to be grabbing is del monte fruit is on sale for a dollar and 99 cents each and there was a one dollar printable coupon that i printed from the del monte website i'm going to leave that linked on the breakdown and in the description box um, I'm going to grab Arizona iced teas. They are four for $2. And your girl has the two off eight CRT in her app. I'm still not going to go touch the red box. There's really no need for me to. There's no instant coupons or anything that I really need. Um, I'm using as many digitals as I can. And I do have a printable. Fiji waters are two for $4. Makes them $2 a bottle. I paid about $1.91 per bottle at Walmart. But I'm just going to grab a couple in CVS because I'm here already. And then General Mills cereal is $1.99 and we have a 50 cents app only coupon. It makes a box of cereal $1.49. So if you need cereal, General Mills is on sale. And then another deal I just threw on here is the Huggies diapers are buy one get one 50% off. And when you spend 20, you get a $5 extra buck. We have a three off two coupon in our CVS app. So that is everything that's on the top deal. So I'm going to go in. I'm just going to go aisle by aisle to see if there's anything else that I'm missing. Anything else that's worth a good deal. I'll check paper products. I will check cleaning supplies, hand sanitizer, hand soap, all that jazz. And let you guys know what I find. So if you're interested in seeing my CVS haul, then just keep on watching. General Mills cereal and Kellogg's are $1.99. There is a General Mills coupon in our app, so you can get them for $1.49 per box, but even still, $1.99 per box for cereal is good. Over here is the mandarin oranges that we're gonna grab. They're $1.99 each, so we're gonna grab two. And I printed from the Del Monte website a $1 off two coupon. So Kinsley likes oranges. I grabbed her two mandarin oranges, and we're going to end up paying two. 98 for two or a dollar and 49 cents each so that is the first deal that we are doing um one other thing i want to point out is that they have pasta sauce two for four i don't think we have any prego coupons but i'm gonna go ahead and just double and triple check in the cvs app to see if there are any so what you do is just go to the cvs app and we're going to we already have plenty of soup at home kinsley gonna click on deals and rewards i typed in prego there was none. I'm also going to type in pasta. There's no coupons. So there's no coupons. But if you need some cheap for $4, isn't that bad of a deal. So let's keep going. It also looks like they have Dunkin' Donuts various coffees on sale for $4.99 if you want to make coffee at home. This brand, Community Owned Coffee, is on sale as well as the Maxwell House and the Folgers, y'all. So if you want to make some coffee at home, reduce those funds, it's on sale at CVS. All right, so we struck out on Fiji water, but we did manage to get the Arizona iced teas. They're four for $2. So I grabbed 16 of them because I have a two off eight CRT. So I'm going to grab 16 of them for $8, get $2 off. I'm going to end up paying $6 for 16 cans of Arizona iced tea. It makes them 37 cents each. So I didn't get the Fiji water, but that's totally okay because I still have some in my case from... Um, walmart and i'll probably just buy another case from walmart again so let me show you the coupon in the cart so here's 16. we grabbed two kiwi strawberry so that we could try the kiwi strawberry out and then the rest we got our mango and our fruit punch ones that we usually get and then so in my cvs deals and rewards on my card i have a two off eight crt here it is two off eight off coffee and tea items so because this is iced tea it counts so I'm gonna get 16 of these for six dollars making them 37 cents each okay and then here's that cereal coupon for General Mills I was telling you about all right so now let's keep going all right Easter candy is 90% off in my store there's nothing that I really want so I probably won't get anything but they have peeps for 22 cents okay they have starburst grab those starburst for 18 cents y'all I lied let me see they have sweet tarts too. Okay, we're gonna grab a, a couple of these. Okay, come on, Kinsley, because this is what? Is this? 80 cents. Grab one more. If there's one more box, we're gonna grab all five boxes of this Starburst. They're 
18 cents. And then mommy's going to get some of these sweet tarts bunnies. Does it tell me the flavors they have? I like me some sweet tarts. Okay, so I'm going to grab a couple boxes of these. Oh, there's only two, so I got those two. You can grab two cotton candies. They're on sale. They got Jolly Rancher jelly beans. I'm not a jelly bean person, so I wouldn't buy those. They have these fun dips. We're going to see how much they are. We need to scan them. Oh my god, y'all, they have Swedish fish jelly beans. With my braces, I definitely shouldn't be eating them. They have Starburst jelly beans. I don't know what that is, baby. Um, and then they have the little eggs dank stuff down there. I'm not going to buy any of those. What is this? It's a lollipop. Okay, yeah, let's see how much it is. Okay, so check your stores. Ours is 90% off. They have these chocolate Why bunnies. Can I get these? No, put that back. That's not on sale. Put that back. Yeah. They have these um chocolate bunnies, y'all. 49 cents, 39 cents, 59 cents. I like chocolate. 15 cents chocolate bunnies. Yeah, but we're not buying it. Okay, so if you need jelly beans or anything, you we can grab the Skittles. Get the Skittles. So we'll see how much they are. Get two of them. Okay, so yeah, y'all. 90% off Easter candy. And this is what we got in our cart. I don't know how much it is, but we're going to see. Okay, let's keep going. So it looks like they're still stocked on these Fiora paper towels. So that seems like it's a good sign that they are stocked still on paper towels. So the pet food, if your pet eats any of these, they're buy 10, get a $3 extra buck. Now, my cat likes these. So if these were individual, I would buy them, but they are not. Um, okay, so they are semi-stocked on paper towels. They have some single rolls. They have some brawny, some bounty, some seven generations, some scots, and some basics. And then toilet paper, it looks like they have this Charmin available. That's it. And then they have these individual rolls of toilet paper as well. And then to get to the cleaning aisle, cleaning aisle is still looking real bare, y'all. Still bare, still bare, still bare. I definitely need dish soap. <laughs> I grabbed some at Dollar General, but I still may grab these because these are 99 cents and I usually try to grab them whenever they are. But I got some big ones at Dollar General for a dollar and something. So I'm gonna pass on that for now because I have some, okay? Um, but they still don't have any other Lysol or Clorox or anything like that in stock. They're really good on laundry care, so that's not empty. They have lots of Febreze here, um, but just no dis disinfectants, okay? So I'm in the back. I'm gonna look at the diapers for you guys, but I found a restock cart, which that means they're restocking. But I wanted to show all my mamas out there the Huggies, buy one, get one 50% off. And when you spend 20, you get a $5 extra buck. So 18, you probably have to buy at least two packs of diapers and then probably a pack of wipes or something or you might have to buy three packs of diapers in order to get your total over the spin 20 okay and it looks like they got some stuff they got almighty packs checks cheerios i don't see any cleaner on there but all right y'all let me keep going i think that's it i'm gonna check on the playtex deal and then that's it we're gonna get out of here with our junk <laughs> They have hand soap in stock as well, so make sure you check your CVS if you need any hand soap. Okay, so now Kinsley and I are going to go and t uh, check to see how much all this stuff is, and then I'll tally up everything and tell you how much we're going to spend at the register. Um, so CVS is still not back in flus, guys. I don't know what's going on. So it's still not in flus, so I'm going to be paying with my PayPal balance from flus. So all the cash back I've earned, I've cashed out to my PayPal account, and then I'm gonna use that to pay for my items here with my PayPal debit card. So I'm just got my eyes on the swivel trying to see if there's anything else. We're gonna take some pictures over here. So we're gonna check the prices of this kind of OD'd on the candy because it was so cheap. Like this is 39 cents. All these little boxes of like movie size candy are 13, I'm sorry, 18 cents. So I got the Krabby Patties, I grabbed Sweet Tarts, and I grabbed down there Starburst, all right. I got Kinsley some more of this cotton candy. It's only 18 cents. And then the rest of the stuff in the cart is the stuff that I was that I was supposed to get. So I got 16 Arizona ICs, and I got my two mandarin oranges. And that's it, y'all. I checked around. That's it. I don't need anything else. I don't want anything else. So here's my transaction breakdown. It's in the description box if you want to print it out. 
My fruit is three ninety eight. Arizona iced teas are $8, and then all that candy that's in there is literally $3.12. Total book for coupons is $15.00. For coupons, what am I going to use? That $1 off 2 manufacturer coupon I showed you guys. And then that 2 off 8 CRT that's in my account that I showed you guys for the Arizona iced tea. So with that being said, my total is going to be $12.02. I only have $14 in extra bucks. I have a $10 care pass that I'm going to save. And I have two $2 extra bucks, so I'm going to use one of these. It's going to make my total $10.10. I'm going to pay with my PayPal debit card from my coupon budget. So I'm going to pay, I'm going to get all of this stuff for just $10. So 16 Arizona ICs, two packages of fruit, and 17 things of candy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, 14 packages of candy. I'm sorry. 14 packages of Easter candy and Arizona iced tea and fruit for literally $10. So, can't beat that. I'm excited. Oh, I forgot. There's candy under there, y'all. It's it might be it might be 16. I'll let y'all know when I get back home. So, now I really see you guys back at home. Okay. My CVS has this really small Germex. It's 2 fluid ounces. For dollar and ninety-nine cents. So check your CVS and see if they have some, okay? Okay, so the audio was really bad, so I just wanted to voice over this for you guys and let you know that the one thing I don't like about digitals is that the cashiers can put them on as they see fit. So my cashier worked a little bit faster than I anticipated and he used my ten dollar care pass and I did not want him to. So instead of me only paying ten cents. I wanted to save that $10 care pass for later, but it's okay. But that is my one thing I don't like about digital extra bucks and digital coupons at CVS is that the cashier can put those through without you wanting them to be put through. So that's just one of my frustrations with digital coupons. And I'm excited to get back to having paper coupons, but that care pass is never paper. But anyway, I just wanted to tell you guys that I was a little upset. All right, Maximizers, we are back home from CVS, and this is our haul. I mean, we got 16 Arizona iced teas, two packs of mandarin oranges, and we got tons and tons of clearance candy. So let me just pull out my receipt. Everything went according to plan, except, like I told you guys in store, my cashier went ahead and used my $10 care pass without asking me and he did it so fast I didn't even have a chance to say I don't want to use my care pass so he just went ahead and used it so here is like the giant receipt okay it's it's one of those epic CVS receipts that people always joke about us having super long CVS receipts you can see the $1 coupon was for the mandarin oranges then we got two off eight for coffee and tea, my $10 care pass that I did not want to use, and a $2 extra buck. So my subtotal was 10 cents. With tax, I paid 22 cents. So I dug 22 cents out of my wallet, and I paid 22 cents for 35 items, okay? You can see that it says I saved 100% because I did. I basically paid less than a quarter cash out of pocket for all of this stuff, okay? So with that being said, they gave me a $1 extra buck that I did not use, it expired before, so they reissued me a dollar. Thank you, CVS, I appreciate that. And then some of my CRTs printed out and I will save them for next week. So that's it, Maximizers, for my CVS haul. Check your store to see if you have Easter clearance still and if it's marked down. I've been seeing people get other things that are not like candy and Easter related stuff as well. So. Quick updates, I want to let you know that enrollment is open for my Shop With a Purpose course. So if you are ready to dive deep into couponing, budgeting, meal planning, and strategic grocery shopping, this course is for you, all right? It is 11 self-paced modules, which means you can dive in and start learning today. Why is it better than my YouTube beginner series? Because it gives you tutorials, it gives you detailed videos, it gives you an actionable plan to actually execute. It helps you with execution of couponing, budgeting, meal planning, and strategic grocery shopping so click the link in the description box the extended payment plan is open right now you can dive into the course for just $39 okay and then the course enrollment ends on Friday May 15th so after Friday May 15th this course is going into the vault and you will not have access to it all right so I just want to thank you guys so much for your love and support I appreciate each and every one of you can't wait to see you all inside the course 
Now, if you could take a minute, watch one to two more of my videos. I'm gonna leave them linked in this video and at the end and let the ads play through. Views on my videos are very low on YouTube simply because a lot of people aren't couponing. So I would appreciate if you could just take a minute, watch a video, let the ads play through. It would really, really help Kinsley and I continue to bring you this great content, all right? So you guys stay safe as you're shopping out there. And as always, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.